So off we go back to the Leslieville Bike Clinic, I guess, next. I think I'm going to head straight there. I think it's open. Just pull it. No. Ah. That's strange. Uh, it's not really loud. Somebody let you in. A lot of people in there still. Uh, about 10 to 1. We got wind at my back today. Heading back from this uh, Salvation Army uh, lunch. I can't remember the name of this street. I should be able to remember the name of the street. But I cannot. Rathmore and Delcote. Delcote. There isn't a sign on on any of those corners. Anyways, I got a bike clinic to get to. I got to, I got to use the wind at my back to my advantage. See if we got a yeah, look at that. My bail out there was if there was somebody coming from the north I was gonna take the I was gonna head north with traffic. Here the bailout is. Same kind of thing. are all four-way stops so you can there's nobody stopped at the corner there you can pretty well rest assured you're not going to get killed Unless somebody else is running the light running the four-way like me here <sighs> that woman in the green spring jacket there same woman I saw coming in how'd she get way over here? Uh, that's illegal but then looks like the strut of the front left strut is falling off the vehicle means the support for the for the suspension on the front wheel there's broken off from the frame that's uh that vehicle is totaled probably so it's not parked
for him behind me. He seems impatient about getting by me. Well, as soon as you know, I'm going about 30 clicks. What are you doing? It's your right away, right? Her Mrs. is impatient here. I'll catch her at the next stoplight. That's the stop sign here. She's in my way now. But now I'm behind her, so it's not a problem for her. And I scare her in the back windshield here. It's like a variation on the Mack truck behind you. You're not aware you're driving a car, you're not aware that there's a the Mack truck behind you is carrying tons of load and can't stop and start and and there you are on the highway slowing and starting up and slowing and starting up. Monsignor. So we're almost to Jones. Where's this fucking guy going? He's driving like me. Fucking asshole. Didn't work out very well. So lesson learned on that little jaunt there. That's how bicycle couriers run in the car, eh? You don't stop for anything. Oh, you noticed I did stop for major intersections if I had to. But you build up this adrenaline rush. And you're moving, you're thinking about twice as fast as the average car driver. Plus if they... I don't know what they're thinking. I guess I'd have to see a video of a... from a car of a bike courier making moves like that to understand it when I'm bike couriering like that I expect they I expect the cars not to see me I guess okay I'm going down this hill at 35 place fuck the winds coming from the south now I don't get it. Why is there a bus stop at the You know, you got this this donut here, this underpass. Bus stop at one uh, one end of the dip, and then a bus stop at the other end of the dip. All right, everybody.
everybody's gonna go from behind this bus. I'm gonna take it right in front of it. That, ain't way, that way ain't working out. Let's go the other way. Gulp! That ain't getting the great barber going. March today, 15th, March 15th. That's a nice place. Front detail. Okay, I'm gonna slow her down a little bit here. We avoid death a little bit. Turning into a evil can evil. Videotron. Not a good plan. He ended up dead. Vain and dead. So, swinging around the corner, coming up to Dundas Street. And around the corner, right into the middle of Dundas Street on that corner. And I'm gonna take Boston Ave just before the lights here or after the lights here. This is Pape. A couple of blocks after the light here, down Boston to Queen and the bike clinic. So every corner of, uh-oh, forgot to get ahead. Now everybody's slowing down, so traffic bunches up, can't make a turn. Very nice. Yeah, so here it is. Uh, the gentrification of a neighborhood. This changes uh, demographics just like that. And now Mr. Ford wants to redraw the boundaries probably of this ward, I wouldn't doubt. Try to get rid of the, the Paula Fletcher problem. But I guess he's got more than just a Paula Fletcher problem, doesn't he? 2518, I think, is the number. So there's about six of them he has to redraw out of existence in order to privatize the city. Right-wingers think the, the main the main tide in the universe is towards a socialist uh, totalitarian government, and the left-wing uh, narrative would be that there's a an extra slide to corporate totalitarian totalitarian government. Interesting couple, and here we are at the South Riverdale Community Health Center bicycle clinic just like that
see how long that took. Jungle, how are you doing? Just getting the prayers. Third eye, man. It's Buddhist. Wow, a lot of deliveries today, eh? Just a few. Maybe for the video presentation last week, they had the video screen set up here. Maybe uh, somebody stole our lighting, eh? Lighting, no more lighting. Well, we're gonna be making mistakes now. Okay, yeah. Uh, 